my dear learner welcome to color pharma today we are going to discuss about a calculations of sa by uv's visible spectroscopy we were going to discuss about uh, calculations those who are newcomer on my channel please subscribe it and press this bell icon so as and when i upload a new video it reach to you very fast let us go and uh, uh, discussion about the calculations so what are the informations required we required a uh, preparations that is standard preparations standard absorbance we required that is sample preparations and sample absorbance this is an absorbance then we required that is an average weight so that average weight we take from the uh, from the 20 tablet we weight individual on a weight balance and then we will do then we have required a label claim that is 150 mg then standard potency that is 99.85 percent is given to us so this is obtained from the tablet strip and this is obtained from the standard working standard or reference standard coa certificate of analysis from that we can get it so let us see uh, standard preparations so how the standard preparation is we have taken a 100 mg of tablet where api active pharmaceutical ingredient or a working standard into 100 ml volumetric flask from that we have taken 2 ml and transfer it into a 10 ml volumetric flask. Second, test preparations. So, in case of test preparation, we have taken a 300 milligram tablet powder. This is tablet powder containing excipients as well as API. This is only active pharmaceutical ingredient transfer it into 100 ml volumetric flask from that we take a 2 ml that is transferred to 10 ml volumetric flask this informations i have written from this the 100 mg transfer into the 100 ml volumetric flask from that 2 mg 2 ml transfer into the 10 ml volumetric flask here 300 mg tablet powder transfer into the 100 ml volumetric flask from that we take the 2 ml and that is transferred to the 10 ml volumetric flask. The absorbance rate standard is 0.5 and test is a 0 0.4. I, I am giving you a direct equations that will help you to calculate the assay. So, percentage assay is equal to absorbance of unknown divided by absorbance of standard into weight of st uh, standard divided by here we have transfer into the 100 ml volumetric flask so i am writing the 100 into 2 by 10 we have dilated to the volumetric flask to we have taken the 2 ml transfer to 10 ml volumetric flask and make up it heat ye ho gaya standard ka now for the test how to do the test for the test we have taken a weight of tablet powder that is taken into the 100 ml volumetric flask so this is in a inverse form this is flowing in this directions this is flowing in this directions okay this is in this way and this is in this way so from that we have taken a 2 and transfer to the 10 ml if here further we have taken a 3 into a 50 ml sorry this would be like this 10 into 2 so the flow is like this okay into we have to take uh, average weight divided by label claim into potency so how we are getting here suppose this is 2 and 10 uh, if further it is 3 into 50 if it is there then we have to write here 3 into 50 if it is there but here it is not given 
so we will not write it. So, for any dilutions you have to follow this way and for the taste you have to follow this way. So, whatever the dilution is there you can write it. So, the variable would be this we can get the changes here we can get change at here also. So, let us see absorbance of unknown is uh, 0.45 and the standard is 5. So, 0 0.45 divided by 0 0.5 this is 2 into weight of standard we have taken that is 100 milligram. So, that is 100 divided by 100 into 2 divided by 10 tablet powder weight is 300 milligram into 100 into we have 2 into 10. So, 10 divided by 2 the average weight we have to check the average weight average weight is 500 milligram label claim is 150. So, we see that average weight is uh, 500 milligram label claim is 150 into potency is 99.85 that is given from the certificate of analysis. So, after that you can do this all calculations that you are getting the assay is round about 99.84 percentage. So, what are the possible change? What are the possible change? See average value you will get label claim is you are getting potency you, are, you can get it. change If you see here you will get the change at here also or if you can also get the change at here also. Agar if we have a change in the standard, we have to move numerator divided by denominator. If we have a change in the test, then we have to follow denominator divided by numerator. So, whatever amount we are taking that we have to keep in the denominator. Suppose we have taken 2 ml, then 2 ml is in denominator. Here we have taken the 2 ml in the standard that is in present in the numerator. So, in this way you can do the calculation. So, this is my attempt to show you this calculation about the assay for by UV spectroscopic standard absorbance method. If you have any doubt or related any topic, so you can share me or comment me, I can send it also. Thank you, thanks a lot.